Welcome to Web Press. Let's say you don't have cart icon to click at in your WordPress WooCommerce store or there is not enough space in header to place cart icon or you just don't want to place cart icon in header like this. We have alternative for that. Improve customers buying experience and increase sales and conversions by using a modern floating cart or side card for WooCommerce in WordPress. Display a card icon with items count visible at the bottom of the page. When the customer clicks at it, a sliding card will be displayed. From plugins area, search for floating card for WooCommerce. XT floating card for WooCommerce. Install and activate. XT plugins, floating cart, even its free version has sufficient features. Reload shop, let's add some products to cart. Add to cart, and you see this cart icon at the bottom of the page. Click add it and it will display the product that is added in the cart. You can add products in cart via Ajax. Product quantity will be updated as you add or remove products in cart. You can even undo product removal easily. Let's update quantity and the price has been updated. Let's remove the product. We can undo removal of product. Let's add more products. And from here, you can go to checkout page, shop. There is one more thing that you can improve in this card for free. You can display a link to view card page here. To do that, I'll go to theme file editor from appearance, footer.php, before closing body tag, script tag, Append a link to cart page via jQuery for cart header area. Class that we will target is this xt vfc header right dot append view site URL slash cart update file. Refresh the page to style this link. I will add a class here. Reload page. This is better. If I click here, it will take us to card page. Style it as you like via CSS or use icon instead of text link. Plugin is easily configurable via its settings page that you can check yourself by exploring this area, floating card. Also, if you display products via custom loop and want to update this card count on demand via Ajax, then on click of a button or something, you can call a function. XT VFC refresh card. That function will update card count easily via Ajax. I use this is to use floating card plugin if I need it in WordPress WooCommerce based sites. Okay, I hope it helped. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.